this is what guys we look good when they are actually in the use of the sunken lights. That is a 14 one. It's a money rock music headlines. Uh Pantera. Uh Pantera Pantera drummer Billy Paul says that Pantera is bigger than than it ever was. Um uh Motley Crew. Uh former member John Karabi was for uh Fretman of uh Mot Crew back in the heyday. He explains his nineteen E lawsuit against Motley Crew. That something that happened years and years ago. Uh Blue Fire's drummer Terry Hawkins say he says he he says he doesn't like Christmas because Christmas is it star. Hey, I'm not gonna take anything away from Terry Hawkins. Heck of a good drummer. I guess uh, Jason Newsom's uh, new group and uh, new set is uh, no more. He says that uh, Jason is he plans not to re to revive his band music because they're only one big album that they the band has released. You know, I gotta say, I saw Jason Newsom for a guy who's been with Metallica, started so playing his own group. Well, that group is done, but. Uh, from Megadeth, I've drawn Nick Nunsay, he's got big plans for the future, because speaking of Megadeth, you guys did know already, they are going through like a new change, a new look this upcoming year, because they said they'll be heading into the studio, recording their latest, uh, their latest album, but uh, Chris Brower quit, he left the group. Their drummer Sean Droner left. So it's kind of like, maybe it's kind of like in, in a pickle that uh, uh, Dave Elson said something that uh, they're not they're not disbanding, uh, they're not, uh, the band's not going away because of uh, four members left. Maybe, maybe, uh, being, uh, they just uh, looking for. I know they're looking for a new, uh, a new uh, lead guitar. They're looking for a new drummer. Uh, Metallica game uh, producer Bob Rock. He says he doesn't see him working with Metallica uh, because maybe Metallica is going in a new direction, a new, a new producer. Uh, Buck Cherry from him, Josh says is that they're working on at least now coming out the uh, next series of guys that they just released uh, not too long ago, uh, like a, a new EP album. But uh, Josh says of Buck Cherry says that uh, they're having fun writing more new songs for this uh, upcoming album. Uh, Slayer for Slayer for Day and Borrow on his quote unquote return to say he is he doesn't rule out returning and says my door is always open because Bay of the Bar also said I think the last time says he's offering Gate to join Big Desk for for uh, for their new drummer. Um A C D C Um if you guys didn't know there is just a bit of a documentary slash battle pick on um, the late great uh, Brian Scott for frontman of ACDC and also members of ACDC Brian Jones and Angus on to, ex to explain the meaning behind Rock or Bust because I think ever since when they released all of them I thought you know what I, I just think that this should have been ACDC's last run because for Donna's been around for years and uh, Alcon left the group because he had the mental slash stroke and their drummer for the room uh, went AWOL because he got arrested in New Zealand 
But uh, also speaking of ACs, this was uh, just a uh, breaking news. Uh, next year's Grammy Awards, February 8th. Next year they're performing at the at the next year's uh, Grammy Awards. We'll see how see how easy he does perform at uh, at uh, next year's uh, Grammy Awards. That is going to be probably up for discussion by the time when next year's Grammy Awards come around the corner. See who's performing. See how easy it sounds when they perform live. Uh, um. This was, um, and speaking of, as I mentioned, the very first story to use the Money Rock Music Island of Pantera, it was a little while back of, that uh, Philip was a single of form of Pantera, so he wants to reform Pantera, and Big Ball was kind of like he didn't want any part to do it because they didn't want to like, uh, ruin the memory of uh, Diane McDowell, but uh, it's like, well, a possible Pantera reunion, you just, I'm just a phone call away. Maybe if Pantera does come back with a new look, speaking of being Paul, uh, now with uh, Hell Yeah, he started crying when he first heard the uh, song called Moth. But, uh, what are you guys enjoying with the Rockers' Good Lives?